Wayne Estes was an All-American basketball player for Utah State University from 1963 to 1965, and to this day is still regarded as the best cager in school history. A native of Anaconda, Montana, Wayne came to Utah State in the summer of 1962 as a great all-around athlete who looked more like a football player than a basketball player. However, by the end of his freshman year, Wayne had proved all of the doubters wrong as he set the USU freshman scoring record with 254 points. As a varsity starter at the beginning of his sophomore season, Wayne would go on to play and start in all 75 games during his illustrious Aggie career, as he was held under 10 points just once and wound up with 31 20-point games, 18 30-point games, 7 40-point games, and a USU school record 52 points against Boston College during his senior season. Aggie fans were filled with excitement as they entered the George Nelson Fieldhouse on the night of February 8, 1965. They were excited to watch their hometown Utah State Aggies face Denver University, but they were also excited about the possibility of their local hero, Wayne Estes, eclipsing the 2,000 career point total. Wayne, too, had thoughts of becoming just the 18th NCAA player ever to score 2,000 points, while at the same time setting a new Nelson Fieldhouse single-game scoring record, which was 45 points held by Max Perry. As Wayne prepared for the game that night, he complained of numbness in his shoulders, arms, and hands. 